So hey, what is up you guys? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I will be doing a what is on my iPhone. I currently have the iPhone XR white in 64 gigabytes, if you were wondering. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, which you guys requested to see first. So be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Also hit the post notification bell so you are notified every time that I upload a brand new video. Don't forget to follow any of my social media. They will be here on the screen as well as the description down below. The way that I will be filming today's video is I'll just be showing you guys my favorite apps because I feel as though if I go through every single app on my phone, it'll be boring. With that being said, let's hop right into today's video. So I'm gonna quickly just screen record. Um, the screen will be here so you guys can see it. All right, so first things first is my lock screen. I'm just gonna slide down so you can see it. So it is just this wallpaper that I got from Pinterest. I'll have it on my Pinterest hopefully down here or something or just in the description. And it says God is on your side. I like to have quotes as my lock screen because I just like it so i don't want to go through each and every single app on my phone because y'all should know the basic apps that come on the phone so i'm just going to show you my favorites that way i think it'll move quickly so let's just hurry up with this all right so before i get into any of the apps as you can tell by my phone i keep it very clean and kind of color coordinated so this is just how it looks uh, my favorite apps on the first page would have to be Shazam. Um, if you don't know what Shazam is, it's you hear a song on the radio or wherever you are and it can pick up the song like that within a few seconds. So I'm going to show you guys. So yeah, you tap that right there, the song should pick up, you go to the left hand corner and in here you can find whatever you Shazam. So it's easy for you to go back if you don't remember which you were listening to. Yeah, that's Shazam. So it's a pretty cool app. Be my Jesus folder. I use the King James Version app. Um, I use that for my verse of the days. Sometimes I read the devotional of the days. I'm not gonna lie. And then I only use Sprinkle of Jesus for their quotes that they post daily. So that's my stuff. Actually, let me show you guys my King James Version where I do my church notes. And that's if I feel like taking notes that whenever i go to church because i'm not gonna lie sometimes i just want to sit and listen to the preacher preach i'm gonna go to january because i know it's better i will do a video on i guess some of my church notes like more faith related videos which will be coming very very soon uh! on here you guys can see my home screen a little better it is just plain white background with silver stars on it that's also in, um, on my pinterest if you guys want to go check it out the first folder that i'm going to show you guys is going to be my social media then i'm going to go to instagram which is honestly my favorite app like ever you can always catch me on instagram so this is my insta if you guys can follow it it's underscore it's angel sarah it's always um i always have it like pop up on the screen or i always have it linked in the description it's just how my instagram looks right now i'm currently doing a new feed i think i might switch my feed for the summertime and then come back to this feed for like the fall or whatever fall but i don't know depends on how i feel so yeah that's just my instagram if you want to follow me then i have snapchat if you guys want you ugly yeah, if you guys want to follow me on Snap, um, this is my Snapchat. I don't really use it, so my views ain't popping, as you can tell. 43 people saw it. I post every once in a while on Snapchat. The next app that I use a lot would also be YouTube. Hey, what's up? Subscribe if you haven't already. I don't really need to go into YouTube. Pinterest. Let me tell you all about Pinterest. This app helps me so much with outfit ideas or like picture ideas, just ideas in general. <laughs> so if y'all want to follow me on Pinterest, this is my Pinterest. It's 
think it's just angel serum but i have a lot of um really nice boards if y'all want to go check them out y'all can tell the stuff that i'm into on my pinterest y'all need to go hop on the pinterest wave because pinterest is such a great app honestly then i have netflix we have gmail twitter i don't really use yeah i don't really use twitter but i have it bitmoji is just the little character icon for snapchat you should know what it is if you have it then i have soundcloud i have that because my god brother he posts his music there and i have yolo which is also for snapchat but i've used it once and i'm probably going to delete it very very soon because i don't need it so the next one will be instagram but i want to dedicate a whole video um just to a how i edit my instagram pictures plus my instagram story so be on the lookout for that because i always get asked how i do that so subscribe and hit the post notification so you don't miss when that video comes out vsco i'm actually going to go into this app but i'm not going to show you how i edit my pictures but i'm just going to show you guys kind of what my stuff looks like if you guys want to follow me on my vsco my vsco um you can see the name right up there angel sarah um, I'm currently paying for VSCO X. So basically on VSCO X, it gives you more filters, or presets, um, editing tools, and the short little videos as you can see here. So I'll show you one. Yeah, really, really cool. And I like it. Honestly, I don't mind paying a dollar something a month for this. So it's definitely helped me with my Instagram game. I'm not gonna lie. Next um, folder that I use the most would have to be my YouTube folder. In here, I use my YouTube Studio the most because this is where I like to check my analytics. I like to see um, my subscriber count as well, and then I also like to reply to comments on here because it's so fast and easy. Rather than me having to go onto YouTube and have to go to the video and then reply like that. So this way is definitely much more easier so if you're a youtuber you should definitely download this app so that's that and i have sub count um which is a little faster as well well it's faster than me having to go on to my youtube studio because sometimes it takes a little long for it to kind of update so that's why i have that oh and i use my fire stick remote on here it has nothing to do with youtube but my physical remote is actually dead so hence why i have this app my last folder that i'm going to show you guys will be my shopping slash lifestyle now we can go into our shopping and lifestyle folder so what the ones that i use the most on here would have to be amazon shein fashion nova the my alive app which is my phone carrier um I play Subway Surfers when I'm like really really bored. Allegiant is just the airline that I use when I travel to my sister. Um, Google Drive, if you guys don't know. If y'all don't know what Google Drive is, it's, it's a lifesaver honestly because say you want to get rid of some photos on your phone but you're too attached because you don't want to delete them. Google Drive is the way to go because you can save those pictures and videos in there and you won't have to delete them for good, if you know what I mean. I, I don't think I explained that right just now, but roll with me here. Um, then I have Player GR. If you guys don't know what that is, it's a music app. Obviously, it has a music symbol. Um, but on here you can cache a song into your phone not directly into your phone but on the app and then you can listen to the song without internet and you can watch the video too so I have that app even though I do have a ton of songs on my um, music this? on my music app um, then I have Tap and Eat um, Bohemians if any of y'all watching this y'all should definitely hop on Tap and Eat because it's almost like a Uber Eats if y'all know what that is. You order food online, they come and they pick it up. I mean, they come and they drop it off to you. So it's a really good app. Except I think their their delivery prices are just a little, you know, over the top. But overall, I really like that idea. Then 
I use I have my Kindle app on here even though I have a physical Kindle but I don't always use that like I should but this is just for on the go and I don't feel like carrying my Kindle everywhere so I have books on here because I want to get back into reading this is my phone thanks for invading my personal space you know my privacy oh. Okay guys, so that's basically a what is on my iPhone. I just wanted to show you guys my favorite apps that I use. I can't talk. Oh, why am I so frustrated? Y'all wanted to see this video first, so here it is. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up down below if you did. Subscribe button and also hit the post notification bell because I have a lot of up and coming videos in the store for y'all. Follow any of my social media, they'll be here on the screen as well as the description down below. So I will just see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! I need a Bahama mama One who ain't really with the drama Girl, you know you water than the sun, uh. More than a tango, I swear you keep it on, uh, yeah Girl, you know that you the best I also apologize because I was very boring in this video as I just watched the clips back. Alright, love you guys! <laughs>